Hello and welcome to the Sunday Afternoon Modular. First of all guys, we are not far away from a thousand subscribers. I would have never thought this when I started this channel three years ago. If you're not a subscriber yet, you can make me very happy by becoming a subscriber. It's the easiest way to support my channel. Together we can hit a thousand subscribers. Let's do it! Ever wanted a built-in speaker in your modular Eurorack system? Well, in this video we're gonna have a look at the mini speaker from Clectronics. I bought the mini speaker as a DIY kit, so this means I had to solder it myself. It's actually quite a good kit for beginners. So if you have never soldered anything and are not sure if this is something for you, the Clectronics mini speaker might be just for you. It's a very easy build, you will have to solder resistors, capacitors, a jack socket, a potentiometer and so on. And it comes with a very good assembly guide that shows you step by step what to do, including pictures. I've soldered quite some modules by now and some have put really good work into their assembly guides to really guide you through step by step. And some others are pretty weak, only giving you minimal information probably meant for more experienced people. And I think that is quite a pity. They should put a bit more work into a good assembly guide. Back to the electronic speaker. If we take a look at the module from the front, we have a speaker, an input jack and a knob to adjust the volume. The build lets you choose whether you want the jack socket on the left and the potentiometer on the right side or if you want it the other way around. Don't expect too much of the speaker, of course, because of its small size, it is especially lacking in bass. But I have to say I like it. I can go everywhere with my case and just need power and can jam around a bit. Note that, of course, it is mono. If you want it to be stereo, you have to get the second speaker and, as an example, connect the left output of your stereo mixing module to one speaker and the right output to the second speaker. Voila, stereo! Of course, you could also use headphones instead of a mini speaker. I will show you a small headphone amplifier for your Eurorack system in one of the next videos. Alright, now let's hear what this speaker is capable of and compare it to some small computer speakers. Which of course is a bit unfair, but just that you have a reference. The sound is recorded through the built-in microphone of my camera. Thank you. 
That's it for the electronic speaker, two points why it is cool. It's an affordable, easy for beginners DIY kit. And I have a small speaker in my case everywhere I go. That lets me jam around without having to carry some other speakers with me. This said, I hope you liked the video. If so, leave me a like, a comment and subscribe to the channel. And see you next time on the...